Yeah. I was about to ask you, you have seen your, your book is very, your work is very fascinating because you have captured that entire politics of uh, Uttar Pradesh from post partition till 1986. How do you re reconcile with this fact? Here is Congress party being accused of uh, doing this politics of uh, appeasement and from your book and with data that you have tried, you have cited a lot of examples uh, that how actually the Muslims in Uttar Pradesh were discriminated mm -hmm. uh, in government jobs, in recruitment and all kind of places. So how, how do you think this narrative build? I mean, here was a political party which was actually trying to, you know, uh, put a lid on uh, 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 you know, uh, what was the, the bringing a particular community into a national mainstream or say. And there was, and at the same time, it's being accused of, uh, you know, a sort of, uh, you know, giving them a, f a favorable position, even if it was not backed by uh, 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 in terms of uh, jobs or employment, etc. Or see, political empowerment. See, uh, if you ask me whether the narrative comes from, uh, with respect to the uh, Congress, it comes from that use, extensive use of the term secularism. Uh, whoever I interviewed during the course of my, uh, um, uh, of my uh, uh, PhD, uh, if they didn't know, uh, uh, if they were not aware of the other aspects of politics or society, they were certainly aware of secularism as a word. What it meant they all had their own definitions of uh, 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 secularism. Yes, uh, to a great uh, uh, degree um, uh, in Uttar Pradesh in particular, a, a large part of the complaints that went to the Congress High Command and which are registered in the AICC papers or even in the Humayu Kambir papers, a large part of the complaints uh, uh, were that uh, uh, Muslims were being shunted out of service, they were not in uh, 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 defense services, they were not in strategic services, they were not in police uh, uh, services. And uh, um, uh, while, uh, um, I, uh, and these were uh, complaints to the Congress High Command, and while at the same time, the Congress was issuing tickets to people who had, uh, um, who, who were uh, erstwhile Muslim leaguers, uh, they had uh, caused, uh, uh, um, uh, they had uh, advocated the cause of Pakistan. So that dichotomy uh, was something that I capture in my uh, book. On the one hand, Congress was, uh, um, uh, and Congress leaders like Sampoon Anand, P.D. Tandon, they were of the view uh, uh, that uh, we now need to uh, keep the, uh, the interests of the uh, majority also in mind. They cannot be completely ignored. While, uh, while at the same time, there was Nehru, who, on the other hand, who was expressing a completely different opinion. Oh, uh, they are minorities. They need to be protected. But they were never protected. Uh, 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 they were never given the representation, uh, um, despite Nehru's advocacy uh, uh, for uh, uh, not uh, uh, mixing religion and, polit uh, uh, and politics, often during elections.